Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel, or welcome if you are new. My name is Jillian, and today I have a really quick organization. It's going to be in my bathroom. So recently, when I've been going underneath my sink to find something, I'm knocking everything over, and I can't find anything that I need. So I thought it was time to go ahead and organize really quickly underneath there. And I figured since I'm doing my side of the sink, I might as well just go ahead and do my husband's. His side isn't as bad as mine just because he obviously doesn't have as many products and stuff that I do, but his side definitely needs to be cleaned out as well. So I figured I would take you guys along with me, maybe give you guys some motivation. I'm pretty sure this video won't be too long just because I am only doing underneath the sinks. I'm not really doing anything else. Maybe I will do the linen closet as well in there. I'll see how messy it is, but I'm going to try to focus on underneath the sink just because, like I said, anytime I try to find something, I cannot find it and it's driving me crazy. So I'm just going to go ahead and quickly clean and organize that out. So if you guys have any organizing to do yourself or maybe some cleaning, I would love for you to come clean and organize along with me. But enough of my talking. Let's go ahead and jump right into today's organization. All right, you guys. So I'm going to show you underneath my bathroom cabinet. So... This is how everything is looking like. So I do have baskets, but clearly I'm not keeping everything organized in the baskets. So I need to pull everything out and then go through it, see if anything needs to be thrown out and then going ahead, wiping it down inside really quickly and then reorganizing everything. And then hopefully I can keep it nice and organized for a while. And when I go in there to find things, I can actually find it. So let's go ahead and pull everything out. Oh, let me show you guys my husband's side of his bathroom. So I'm gonna show you guys my husband's side so this is my husband's side he also has baskets but clearly he can't keep anything in the baskets as well so I'm going to pull all of the stuff out on his side wipe it down in there and then organize stuff um I'm pretty sure there's like empty boxes there so I'll just throw all that away and yeah get his side nice and organized as well all right, friends, so now that you have seen the before of how my cabinet or underneath my sink in my bathroom and also my husband's side is looking, I'm going to go ahead and start organizing everything. So the easiest way to do this is to just pull everything out. And once I pull everything out, I'm going to wipe it down with a microfiber cloth and just a multi-purpose spray, make sure everything is cleaned off in there. And then I will go into each basket and start organizing. I was able to get rid of a lot of stuff. I originally brought up just a a little shopping bag thinking that I was not going to get rid of a lot I ended up having to go back downstairs for a garbage bag because it was overflowing so I did get rid of a lot of things on both my side and also my husband's side so I'm gonna go ahead and organize everything as best as possible with all of the baskets that I already have Even if we fall, we will rise 
Now that my side is completely done being organized, I'm going to put all the baskets back in as neatly as possible. I think I want to go to Target and see if I can find any other baskets that will fit under here a little better. A lot of these baskets are from either um, Walmart, a Dollar Tree, and I think those are the only two places that I got these baskets from. So I want to see if I can go to Target and get some nicer ones that are different sizes that will probably fit in there a little better. But for now, that'll do. So now I'm moving on to my husband's side. As you guys can see, I'm going to do the same thing. I'm going to pull everything out from his cabinet and then I will wipe it down to make sure everything is nice and clean in there before I go ahead and place everything back in after I organize everything. So I'm going to do the same thing also as I did on my side, which is go through both of his baskets. He only had two or three baskets, go through those and clean it out and then organize everything. And as you guys can see, the bag was overflowing. So I did have to end up going downstairs to grab a garbage bag because everything was falling out. So I'm glad that I I did this because like I said I was able to get rid of a lot of things I've been flipping pages since I could remember that told me I had to be within the lines of two degrees and nine to five And I've been working after work since last September working after work, yeah. I stay up late on the weekdays on the week I days. never tell when we say oh. I never want to look back And wish I could have been I've never got no regret The hours I've been putting in So take a chance on faith You're my All right, you guys, so I am done, and this is how my side turned out. So all the way in the back, I have some personal care items, and then anything that was extra, I just threw in that basket. The small basket over here is a bunch of travel size stuff, so travel size shampoo, conditioner, deep conditioners, mask, stuff like that. And then in here, I have a lot of my facial stuff. So I have my facial toner, I have facial sprays, extra um, face washes, face masks, stuff like that is all in this basket. And then over here is like my body care stuff. This is in the way, it's hard for me to show, but so I have body sprays, I have extra bar soap, um, body creams, loofahs, that's all in this basket. This is my hair care um, basket, so dry shampoo, hairspray, um, protector for when I use any type of heat on my hair, and then extra shampoo and conditioner. And then all the way in the back is all of my um, 
heat tools. So I have my blow dryer, my straightener, curler iron, stuff like that. So that is how my side turned out. And I'll show you guys how my husband's side turned out. And this is how my husband's side turned out. Obviously he has less products than me. So he has a ton more storage, but over here I have all of his like buzzer stuff for him to cut his hair. And then in here is all his personal care items. So he has some facial wipes, some um, body wash, loofahs, lotion, stuff like that. His blow dryer. And then in here is all like the first aid kit stuff. So we have alcohol, we have Neosporin, um, just like band-aids and stuff like that, emergency stuff. So that is what is in that basket. So this is how his side turned out. All right, you guys. So that is going to end my bathroom organization. I'm sorry that this is a shorter type cleaning video, but all I had to do was organize underneath my bathroom cabinets. And I still want to take you guys along with me just to give you guys some motivation, even though it's a shorter type cleaning or organizing video. I was gonna throw in my linen closet that is inside of my bathroom as well but it didn't need to be cleaned out. All I did was refold a few towels that were um, falling apart, not falling apart, but that were knocked down from us getting other towels. But other than that, it didn't need to be cleaned out. So I didn't include that footage, but regardless, I hope you guys still enjoyed watching me organize underneath the cabinets. Now, my husband's side, it did take me a little bit longer than expected. I don't know what spilled, but something spilled in his baskets. I'm guessing it's like some type of like beard oil. I don't know, but it spilled in the bottom of all three of his baskets and then it got sticky. And then on top of that, the hair from his buzzers was all in the bottom of the baskets as well. So I had to rinse it out a million times and then dry it out. So his side took a little bit longer than I expected just because he barely has anything on his side. But I'm glad I was able to finally get this done. Now when I go in my cabinets, I can find things and things won't be falling over. So hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, Please remember to give my video a thumbs up and also subscribe and turn on your notification bell if you haven't already. I would love to have you be a part of my YouTube family. I love you guys and I will see you guys next time. Bye.